Hello, hello everybody and welcome back to Crusader Kings 3 with yours truly, your first Spear Prime Spiders. We are back with uh, King Voldemar of House Telemark. Yes, 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 yes. And um, I have a little surprise here because I have been an idiot. <laughs> I've been an absolute idiot because I thought we had the uh, Viking DLC, but apparently I didn't. I didn't have it. So I picked it up right away. A couple of you guys mentioned it already. Uh, you pointed out that this wasn't, wasn't in fact, that I wasn't in fact playing with the uh, Vikings DLC. So picked it up. Here we are. Everything looks beautiful now. And it looks so familiar. It's so, so beautiful. It is absolutely beautiful. I mean, all these... All these portraits have been updated, like all the UI things have been updated. It's beautiful. Anyway, what were we doing? Uh, thank you guys, by the way, for all your tips and tricks and feedback and all your likes and all your sub subscriptions and all your uh, everything. It's like, it's beautiful. And look at that. This, this is what I mean. I haven't seen this yet. And also the music is different, by the way, which is also beautiful. Like the music is beautiful. So yeah, uh, now one of the things you guys said was uh, have our wife help with chivalry. Uh, it's only going to give us plus one marshal. I'd rather have her just assist the ruler, I think, because that's going to give us a lot more, right? Yeah, that's going to give us a lot more, so I think we'd, we'll just have her uh, assist for a while. Uh, also, right now, we can finally duel, right? So, let's let's go over the notifications real quick. So, you can be ransomed. Let's just do that. I think we're on a raid, aren't we? And we can... Uh, we can uh, uh, oh, look at that. Look at that. This is so lovely. I wanted, I wanted this. All right, so we're talking about Jarl Hafton. So uh, we should be able to uh, to duel you, right? Yeah, we'll be fine. We'll be fine. Let's do this. Let's do this. Um, to death. What happens, House Vitzerk? Alrighty, so you have a couple of titles. You have the Yardom of Jorvik, which is in York, right? Yeah. So, if you die... Okay, so we'll gain... Let's do this. I mean, let, let's do it. Let's do it. I've, I've ac actually never done this in CK3. I'm really, really curious what this is going to, uh, to bring us. Now, before we do that... Uh... Oh, the music is so awesome. Uh, we were going for these, right? Yeah, we were going for these. And then I probably want to have this as well, but this is in Sweden now. Um, I'd like to do a bit more fighting for territory, to be honest. Uh, subjugating Jarl Bjorn would be good. But I'd rather just get the county, honestly. Although it looks like we're not going to have enough uh, troops for that. And we're about even when it comes to strength. How about you, my friend? Because right now we really have to play the big fish. Uh, how about the duchy? Yeah, I'd like to do this. I think Sweden is still our ally. Oh, um. oh man. Yeah, we need to play the big fish right now. And I'd like some uh, armored footmen, honestly. So let's just do that. Let's get some armored footmen. Right, we'll take some time. We'll take a little bit of time to get our troops back up. And then we probably declare war for a duchy against this guy. Yeah. Yeah, we probably need to do this quick. Because uh, Sweden is eating them up. So... Righty, trial by combat in Jorvik. I arrive in the designated spot near Jorvik in good time and find Jarl Hafton is already waiting for me, along with a small entourage of witnesses. Whatever else he may be, Hafton is fit to fight and willing to risk meeting me man to man. The formalities are brief. We all know why we are here and we're long past the point of talking. Weapons are handed out and our retinues retreat to observe from a safe distance. May the best man win. There we go. King Voldemar. For a brief, uh, for a few brief moments, Jarl Hafton and I pace in lazy half-circles, each watching for an opening. I heft my axe, ready to defend myself, while he clutches his axe firmly to hand. This fight may only be till first blood, but that doesn't, e that doesn't ease my nerves. With a sudden, ch with a sudden twitch, a bout begins. Hafton tries hesitantly to launch a quick slash at me, but the blow is easily swatted away. Alrighty. Attack first, attack hard, on guard. 
Okay, okay, okay. This is new. Uh, that the best you've got, you can't even hit me. Me thinks I need to make an example out of you. Butchery. You make a show of your cruel skills as a raider. You gain 12 dread. Increases the likelihood of success. Increases our risk of injury. Uh... I think we'll go for a lightning strike here. And we're actually losing stress from this. Let's go for a lightning strike. Putting all my strength into my first strike, I leap straight for Halfden, hefting my, arc, my axe high into a powerful cleave that sends him reeling. Halfden surges forward, forwards, forcing me back with a quick slash before bringing a high kick up to my chest. I almost topple. My form is good, with only small errors, and Halfden's stance is failing. My opponent's guard is fierce, and I feel far from victory, really. Huh. All right, all right, all right, all right. So this is not going very well. We need to learn how to fight here, jeez. I've, ne I've never done this in CK3, guys. I think it's really, really awesome. And I really like this new uh, new DLC. I'm, I'm really glad we... Uh, I'm really... I feel like an idiot for forgetting it, to be honest. I thought I had it, but yeah. Alrighty. Uh, me thinks I need to make an example out of you. Absolutely. Let's... Um, let's do it. Victory! A grim smile curls over my lips as I launch into a blistering series of powerful cleaves. Each strike putting more force, uh, more focus on pain than victory. Halfden staggers and sacks with each blow, but every ripple of delightful pain that courses through him only spurs me to fight harder. By the time he collapses, he's gasping for breath and spitting up thick ropes of blood. I prepare to lazily split his skull in two. I'm almost disappointed to hear a tor tortured yield before my axe can fall. I am victorious. Cool. Injury risk score, right, he gains the trade wounded and we, all temporary character modifiers have been removed. Did we have any temporary character, I don't know. We are victorious. Victory, resting easy, uh, resting easy back in Thrimlingar, Thrimlingar, right. I exult in my success, my, I'm, not, I'm not sure how to pronounce this letter, so if anyone, anybody in the comment section knows how to do that, let me know, because I'd like to pronounce it correctly. My axe laid across my lap, the satisfying aches and pains rippling across my body, the satisfying aches and pains rippling across my body remind me of small moments in the bout, little victories and fierce fought defeats, each winding towards Halfden's loss. A sack of silver rests against my shin. The satisfying weight of a uh, weight, a testament to justice, well served. I had each count. I had each coin counted one by one in front of everyone before we rode home. Yesterday we put our quar quarrel before the before the gods, and the gods answered wisely. Justice is served. Good. That was cool. That was really cool. Can we do it again? Somebody else? Can we, um... Do we have any rivals? No, we have a ward. Right. How about you? You're not a Viking, are you? Yeah. You're Gaelic. I think we can only duel Vikings, right? Yeah, probably. Probably. Okay, so. Uh, a couple of things we need to talk about. One of the things that you guys said was that we would be able to... Where is it? High Kingdom of the North Sea, I believe that's it, right? So, England, Denmark, and Norway. So, the kingdoms of England, Denmark, and Norway are a natural match. I, I agree. Rich, fierce, and bound together by trade and noble blood. If only someone could overcome their individualism, wedding the three permanently. I th uh, a couple of you guys already mentioned that this would be a pretty, pretty cool, uh, cool end of the campaign, right? Try and um, try and establish the North Sea Empire, and I agree. I think that would be a really, really cool thing to do. So I want to, I want to go for this. I think this, this should be our, uh, this should be our goal. And once we reach our goal, if we reach our goal, by the way, because we can die, right? We can die. We're playing this the Viking way. Viking way does have a couple of, uh, there are a couple of insecurities, let's say. Um, but I think this would be a a cool goal for now, at least. So, that's one thing answered. 
and then after we after we achieve our goal, then we'll, we'll see. We'll see whether we keep playing or whether we start a different campaign. But for now, I think we have plenty to do. So also, let me set a timer because I forgot and I will keep playing if I do not set a timer, which uh, I won't mind, but I think Mrs. Pilus is going to be annoyed by, uh, with me. So let's try, <laughs> try and prevent that, shall we? You. I wanted to... Uh, we don't have to have a reason. Okay, well... I kind of want to, kind of want to fight people now. <laughs> uh, do we have a reason for you? No, we don't. Uh, yeah, that's that. That would be weird. Don't want to fight a child there. Uh, yeah, I'm not gonna, not gonna, not gonna fiddle around in that uh, in that war. We still have uh, enough. We we need we need to get more domain, right? We need a bigger domain. Domain, basically. We need more holdings. And I kind of wanna, kind of wanna get get some from Sweden, if I'm being honest. Uh, yeah, you're way too strong. Damn it! An escaped thrall. Thralls are in are a fact of life in Norse culture. Yep. Lower humans captured from abroad or born of thralls themselves. They work our fields and take care of our heart hearths. In theory, last night one such slave decided she had enough. Okay, she fled, taking an armful of valuable jewelry with her. And what's worse, my marshals. Yeah, sorry guys, I don't know how to pronounce this. Uh, it's Polish, isn't it? I think it's Polish. Yeah. Beautiful language, by the way, but I can't. I just can't pronounce it. Saw the thrall rushing into the dark and didn't think to tell anyone before morning. Till morning. Alrighty. Uh, uh, okay. Get my cloak, I think. A martial challenge. I, I like martial challenges. We are playing this the Viking way, right? So that's a lot of fighting. That's a lot of fighting, basically. Uh, we. What is our mar uh, our marshal doing at the moment? Yeah, I thought so. Let's let's organize the levies for a bit because um, I need this number to go up like fast. Right, I need to make sure. Right, yeah, we need to make sure. Oh. Man, I'd really like to do some more raiding if I'm being honest. Oh, look at those helmets, man. Rani is the true father of your child. Okay. Uh, I don't like that. So everyone will know. And this might give us a... No, it doesn't. It doesn't, damn it. Uh, just, I don't think just is good in your case. So let's not be just. Uh, what did you get? Damn it, I need to pay more attention to this stuff. Just like... Uh, <laughs> just like... Um, you guys pointed out that I didn't look at the uh, court physician at his skills, and I just appointed somebody who was not good at, like, being a court physician. Which was, um... Are we paranoid? Yeah, we are. Damn it, but we need more, we need more uh, champions, so... Oh, uh, what can we do to burn off the stress? I think we can burn off the stress, right? Uh, we can adopt special succession type. We already talked. We also talked about that. So, because there's a Scandinavian uh, thing, right? Let's actually think on this. I think that would be good. Uh, Scandinavian elective. Yeah, there we go. So. I think Scandinavian elective could be good. Uh, I think it's better than partition, right? Let's let's check that real quick. Cause let, let, let's take some time here to, uh, to check that. So right now we are on Confederate partition. Uh, so our titles will be divided equally between our children, right? New titles may be created for younger realm heirs, right? Now the ancient ways uh, will have Scandinavian elective if we follow the ancient path, right? Vassal swearing title allegiance uh, can nominate a title heir amongst the ruler's extended family and any available claimants. Right, so, but does the heir... I, I, we'll have a thing, right? Um, so, but does the... Hmm. I, I believe that we don't lose any titles, right? Once we go to Scandinavian elective. I believe that is the case. Let's do it. 
So, let's check the election. election. Um, we'll nominate our son and heir. Here we go. Now, you should be our heir. There we go. Wow. You have a lot. How do you get so many votes? Okay, let's check whether we actually made the uh, made the right decision here. So, is that not in Norway? It is in Norway. Then why do they have their own? Wait a second. Are we not? Are we not winning the election? Over there. Ah, wait. This is just uh, it's just the Scandinavian uh, kingdom, right? Yeah, that's just the Scandinavian kingdom. Uh, okay. So. Uh, let me uh, let me check this all. Let me check all this real quick. So we have this Yaldum. Uh, I'd like a Scandinavian elective here as well, and that's going to cost us a lot of prestige. Yeah, we need Scandinavian elective every everywhere, right? That is that is basically the case, I believe. I believe that is the case. Yeah, I'm not entirely sure on that one, but I believe that is how we do it. Uh, I'd like to have mm, peacemaker would be good. Gallant would be good. Let's go for organized march first, I think. Yeah, so since we don't have Scandinavian elective... We have Scandinavian elective in the kingdom, right? And I believe since we don't have Scandinavian elective in the, in the duchy yet, because that is still on confederate petition, right? Yep. Uh, this is still the su succession law. Um, that means that there is still... But that doesn't matter. I don't know. Well, no, I do know. Okay, let me figure this out. Because, uh, man, I feel like an idiot right now. I, f I feel like I'm having a, a brain a brain poof here. It's like... Um... So, we are on Scandinavian elective. Meaning we can vote for our heir. When it comes to the... When it comes to the Kingdom of Norway. Now, we are still on Confederate partition when it comes to these other titles. Now, why why are they still on Confederate partition? I think that's pretty pretty weird, right? No, it's not weird. It's not weird. It's not weird at all. Right. Got it. So... We should probably change uh, the law for at least the duchy as well. And then get a second duchy up here, right? Because that's a duchy title, I believe. Yep. So the duchy of Viken. And then we'll go for Scandinavian elective over there as well. And then we'll give this county to somebody else. And then we would be able to have everybody vote for the same guy. There we go. That I'm Sorry, I had a bit of a brain, brain, uh, brain poop there. Um, a bit of a brain fart. I don't know why. But well, we did it. We figured it out together. <laughs> and it was instant. So that was good. Right. Are we going to be able to do this? We are going to be able to do this. I want to declare this war right now. Because I feel like if we don't do it... Ooh, that is awesome. That is new. I like it. We are commanding this army ourselves, of course. Because that is what we do with the Viking campaign. Let us do it. Ah, damn it. Our daughter died. Oh no, we're gonna get stressed. Yep. We've been overwhelmed. Oh, look at our helmet. It's totally awesome. Stressful situation indeed. Uh, blah, blah, blah. Uh, we must press on. We'll get frozen grief. Is that gonna be good? It's gonna be a moderate health penalty. You know what? We're a Viking. We'll, we'll just drink. We'll just drink. We're a Viking. 
Merge. Everybody merge. Come on with ourselves. Come here. There you go. Right, good. We got the longhouses over there. Maybe we can uh, maybe we can construct some more. No, because we need the prestige. Damn it. Okay, we'll take these lands, and then once we have this, we will probably probably do some raiding again. Because I really want to do some more raiding. Do we have siege equipment? Damn it, we do not. We should have gone. Uh, yeah, we should have gone for siege equipment. Uh, we can't get siege equipment, so it doesn't matter. Let me c correct. Uh, please correct me if I'm wrong about this succession thing, guys, because I really feel like I'm making a mistake here somehow, and I don't know what the mistake is, honestly. Ah, good. Your silver tongue is shining today, my friend. Very good. You, I kind of want to have you uh, do something about control here. Right, let's take that. Boom, got it. Good. Ech. Sure. Yeah, correct me if I'm wrong, guys. I mean, you probably you'll probably do it anyway, right? Because I, I, I don't think I'll have to ask for that, and and that's a good thing, by the way, guys. Because I really appreciate your feedback, and when I say something stupid, then uh, I feel like you guys deserve. Ooh, 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 chances are even. We might actually lose this because we're an idiot commander. Now, if we were to swap this out, we would probably win, right? But we'll do it ourselves. That's kind of that's the rule, right? So let's try this, and we're winning. Good, good. Whew, that was actually a closer victory than I wanted it to be. Now let's uh, let's take this territory. I'd I'd really like to have it. A uh, stranger is brought before us. He has been waiting outside the castle gates for a week. My liege, my guards inform me. Bows deeply. Yeah, I. What do you? What can you do? Because we're we're paranoid and and we don't really. Well, first of all, you don't you don't worship Odin. We could have you have you embrace Odin. It's ninety stress. Wow, that's too much. We have no room for the likes of you, my friend. It's annoying that we are paranoid. I'd like to uh, do something about that, but um, wow, stress gain plus one hundred percent. That's quite a bit, isn't it? No, don't be paranoid. I don't want you to be paranoid. Uh, get ambitious. Ambitious is good. I mean. Uh, Ooh, oh my. Leave all of you. All of you leave. Leave me be. Now let's groom our son to be better than us, right? Because right now you are cynical, temperate, ambitious and rowdy. Rowdy will change. Uh, rowdy is good, by the way. Ambitious is very good. That is very good. Give you a bit of everything. Uh, that is great. Now... Yeah. Hmm. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll come back to that. I don't want more concubines at the moment, honestly. Yeah, there's the act of election. Now, one of these guys has a lot of votes to uh, spare, right? Oh, wait a minute. We have... We have six. Yeah, you have eleven. Why? Okay, I'm going to dive into that. Because this is actually the first time I'm playing with uh, with the uh, new DLC, so... Although, I don't think the DLC has anything to do with that, but we'll see. I'll, I'll do some digging. I'll do some digging. I mean, I have a lot to learn anyway when it comes to this game, which is good. I like that. I really like that. I... yeah, they do grow up fast. Absolutely. Now, since we're still uh, doing stuff here... I think, since you're not that strong at the moment, I think we should just start pushing, right? Yeah, I think we should keep pushing. Oh, I love this music. It's amazing. Let's keep pushing. Cuz um everybody is painting the map right now and if we if we uh if, if we lag behind then we have an issue. Like if we stay behind we'll get we'll get we'll run into trouble. I'm granting you this title by the way. There you go. We'll keep the other one. Fine. Righty. Uh you're done. Let's command this ourselves and we'll send uh we'll send the army in already. We'll take that. And the rest of them can join them when uh, when they're ready. Enemy ally joins war. That is alright. Oh, is that alright? That might not be alright. Uh, that is alright. We'll be able to fight them as well in a bit. I think that's fine. Right, simple palisade. We really need more prestige. So I think after this war we should do some raiding again. I love this music. It's amazing. Ugh, oh, man. Right, you're our daughter. You're a dwarf. You have dwarfism, right? Dwar uh, dwarf... No, what's it called? I don't know. Um, 
I will marry you off matrilineal, maternally, right, as I used to say. Uh, I think it would be good to marry you off to somebody like you. I think that's fine. I do want to do this matrilineal. Let's send that proposal. And we can create a Duchy of Upland, which is actually good. That will give us a bit of... Yeah, that's actually good. It will give us a bit of... Um, a bit of prestige, and we need prestige at the moment, so that is good. And now let's give that duchy to you, because you already hold two titles. We'll give you the other title later. Um, that is going to be the Yaldum of Upland, right? Yeah. Let's grant that to you. Sounds good. Uh, gladly accept the marriage proposal. That is great. Uh, there's an alliance. That's good. And we can call in our ally. I don't want to do that. I would like to have more champions, and I also would like to... Ugh. I would like to have more prestige, honestly. Right, okay, so everybody's in. I am actually going to split the army this time, I think. Uh, let's send these guys forward a bit. So that we can do this a bit faster. Just tell me. Ah, again, really? She keeps cheating on us, right? Look, everyone will know your infidelity, right? I'm pretty done with you, actually. You keep uh, keep cheating on us. You're ill as well. Yeah. Just stay. For now. How's our prison looking, anyway? Hi. Ooh, you're a brilliant strategist. Yeah. How about you? Wow, you are a... Would you make a good court... Could, hmm. Can women be court physicians? Yes, they can, right? She would make a, a fine court physician, I think. So what if we were to negotiate your release, and we, were, we would recruit you, and we would get a hook on you? And we'll negotiate that. There you go. Now, could, would we be able to uh, grant you, appoint you as court physician? There we go. That would be good, right? Let's do that. Uh... And also, I think it would be good if our court physician actually likes us. Ah, that wasn't that wasn't too much. Well, we can sway you, right? I mean, we need to sway more people anyway, so because there's lots of lots of stuff to get from uh, swaying people. Right. So we have a court physician now, which is good. Which is good. Man, I'd like to recruit. We need to check this out more. I think. Like Bercy, for example, he's pretty pretty awesome, right? You'd make a good knight as well. You're a brilliant strategist, experienced commander, has a commander trade as well, flexible leader. It's gonna give us a lot of stress, but let's do it. Let's get you uh, get you in our court. Now we really need to burn off some stress. How old are we anyway? Forty one years old. How old are you? Fourteen. I kind of want to start looking for a uh, spouse here, so we're gonna go for inheritable and. Preferably something that is uh, has something to do with. Oh, this is actually pretty good. Yeah, I like to get some genius children. I'd like to get some genius children. So let's do that. Uh, now we have more. We have more sons, right? Oh wow, we have plenty of sons. Yeah, that's not an issue. Good. Yeah, let's take that. Uh, take that city. Oh man, this game is so ap like it's such a good game. I'm I'm so impressed by Crusader Kings. I'm so impressed by Paradox. It's like cheese. Uh, I think Asta would serve you well as a concubine. Would you let her into your bed? I don't know. Let me check her out real quick. Ah, you're a good diplomat. You're brave. You're honest. You're compassionate. I don't like compassionate, but uh, I also don't really like honest in a lot of situations. But you're a good diplomat. I'm okay with that. Yep. Sure. White piece. Uh, no. I will not agree to that. I am sorry, because that is it. There you go. Force of demands. We will enforce our demands. We will disband our army. And now the question is, I think, shall we do some raiding? Or do we do some fighting? We can get another duchy title, which is good. That gives us a bit of, um, yeah. 
Uh, and then we have these chiefs. What is the deal here? <gasps> Can we fight you? No. We cannot, right? What is that? Raise runestone. Ooh, we'll gain a lot of stuff. But where are we raising this? Uh, recently conquered... Yeah, but we're going to give the county to somebody else. So, no. No. Right? No. Uh, you. What is the deal with you? You are Norse. Uh, I think you are better. Is that in the... Yeah, that's Yamtaland. Yeah, we'll give Yamtaland to you, right? So, we'll give you that, and we'll give you that. And then we'll grant it. Uh, now we can't raise the runestone, can we? Where are we raising this? It's like... Where is this? Only in one of our counties. Okay, well in that case, we'll just raise it in Thrimlingar, right? What to call? Let's do it. <laughs> you want me to pay how much for a giant painted boulder? Right. Every runestone tells a message of some significant event in the life of a commissioner. From the smallest peasant to a king like myself. The stone records all. What shall this monument speak of? Perhaps my vanquished foe. Let's do it. Rocks through the ages location. Now, where are we going to do this? Um, to, where the hell is this? Uh, Agdir, right? Chiefdom of Asdir... Agdir, which is... That's Ausdur. Aus, Auster? I'm probably butchering this. Sorry about that. Uh, let's do here. Oh, there we go. I can just read. Just read Primus. Jeez. <laughs> uh, let's do that. Right, we took some prisoners as well. Maybe we can ransom them. I don't know. I don't think so. I wouldn't mind uh, executing them. It's an act of tyranny here, uh, but not over here. And that's going to give us a bit more piety, which is good. If we were to... Now, I would like to check the males... Honestly. Wow, the females are pretty decent. When it <laughs> These females can fight. Jeez, can we make them into shield maidens? I don't know. I don't know. But we can get some more... Uh, get some more piety out of them. So let's do that. We'll sacrifice them to the gods. Now, I don't think we need to uh, be here to commission that runestone, right? I'm, I'm not sure about that, but maybe we do. Uh, don't No, I don't think we need to be here. We could go on a pilgrimage. Uh, I'd rather do some raiding. So let's do some raiding, shall we? Uh, we because we oh we, wow we have quite a bit of renown actually. So can we get some gathering halls? That would be good because um, that's going to give us prestige. Yeah, let's construct that. And then I would like to get the flag back here, back over here. And I want to do some more raiding because. Uh, Because this is a Viking campaign. I mean, come on. Jeez. Uh, living off the land. supply uh, Rate speed is 25%. That is good. We need that. Um, right. Good. You are going into raiding. And then we are going to command you ourselves. There we go. And where where to raid? Where to raid? I think we should... Oh, these all got raid already. Uh, so let us go to... Yeah, I think I want to go to England. Let's go to the Temple of Whitby. And let's do a, uh, let's do a raid, shall we? There we go. Loot that, and we'll loot that, and then we'll loot. Oh, fire and blood. Uh, yes, capture slaves. Uh, because development is always good. Let's capture slaves. We've taken prisoners as well. We might be able to ransom all of them. We'll probably do a mass ransom or a mass execution at some point. Um, let me check the loots. So there's 12 there, 17 there. Tell me. Uh, okay, fine. Rate that, and then we'll go here, rate that, and then we'll do some rating over here, and then we'll get that, Oop. Ah, you're supposed, to, you're supposed to make me friends, not enemies, you idiot. Get some more. Good, we're getting prisoners as well, which is great. I want to, uh, also, one of you guys mentioned that we should probably get the Pope. Um... Oh man, I, lo I love these rune sticks. 
Right, uh, the latest work of my Chancellor, uh, Toki, has become all the rage at court of late. The piece deals with success and growing greatness, and Toki has publicly dedicated it to me. Right, Corland rage. With when a red plumed war comes to his lands, it'll never find a keener set of hands. His subjects prove grateful, for if they are not, they'll soon see on which side they have fought. So far, I've kept my thoughts to myself, but the buzz has grown too dramatic to ignore this for much longer. Um, I don't quite know how to feel about this, or... I can see this is truly heartfelt. So, I mean, I appreciate it, man. Absolutely. I like you. They do grow up fast. Oh, he came of age. Good. That is our heir. Uh, may you grow strong and wise. Yep. Okay. Let's, uh... You can marry. Let's do that. I'd like them to get some children. Now, if you can get some concubines, that would be good as well. Also, let's ransom you, shall we? Uh, we should probably, probably do some more raiding. Uh, how many troops do you have? Not enough. <laughs> good. They will never be able to fight us. Okay, we can ransom more prisoners. I kind of want to do that. Yeah, let's do that. Yep. Uh, did we get it? We did. Okay, good. So much beautiful money. Loot, 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 loot. It's great. Prisoners taken in siege. That's good. Oh, foreign blood. Uh, captured slaves, as usual. Can we shift click this? Yeah, of course he'll be there. I think we can shift click this. So what we do is this. Right? Yeah, yeah I'll send all of them there. Let's hope this is not going to be like the uh, Red Wedding. Oh, no, we can't shift click. <laughs> okay, well... That, oh, 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 we died. Right. King Valdemar of Nor Nor uh, Norway, the Kingdom of Norway, have crossed the door to the world of spirits at 43 years of age. He drank himself to death. That's a very Viking way to go, right? He's, he ruled for 24 years. One of the best fighters of his age, he was unrivaled in hand-to-hand -hand combat. King Oh, how the hell am I going to pronounce this one? Huncho, hun, Hunchover? King Hunchover, I think. King Hunchover ascends to the throne. Being an ambitious man, many expect the realm to grow and prosper under his rule. Let's continue as the king. Right, now, we have a new heir, our brother. Right, uh, so... We need to nominate a successor. I don't really care, to be honest. I think our half-brother will be our heir, right? It's you, probably. Yeah, that is fine. Now, the only problem is that he, if he is, he's not that ambitious, right? He's humble, yeah. Yeah, hopefully he's not going to kill us, um, but we'll see. Now, you, Yartoki, I think you would be a good chancellor. Uh, well, we'll need a steward. Uh, you're a fine steward. And then we need a spy master, and I think you'll be a great spy master. You, do we need county control? We don't. We have two, two of those. We probably, probably need to see if we can get this back by either murdering this guy. Yeah, we should probably murder this guy. Uh, we have plenty of gold. We might be able to persuade a couple of people. Although I don't really need this. I'd rather have this. But that's our heir right now. So we could keep this guy alive and try and murder this guy because he is 14 years of age. Yeah, let's try that. Let's see if we can kill him. But we need to be careful about this one. Uh, we can transfer you to him. I will do that. I'll do that. Uh, and we need to command this army ourselves, because that's how we do it, right? That is the Viking way, so let's do that ourselves. Uh, we have a lot of loot. Actually, we have more loot than we can carry. So let's let's go back home, get some prestige for that. Uh, we need to focus on something. We should probably... Fo yeah, we'll do, we're will do. we doing this the Viking way, right? So let us focus on chivalry and get more prowess. Now, we should probably also, because you guys mentioned this, and now might be a good time to do that. We should probably also... Uh, we need to get more Dread, by the way. So let's do some killing, I think. Hello? Yep. That seems good. We'll get some Piety. We'll get some Dread. That is good. We'll get some Dread over there. We'll get some... No, that's Tyranny. Who are you? Are we still paranoid, by the way? No. Paranoid. Uh, no, we're cynical. That is good. Cynical, temperate, and ambitious. That's a lot better than what we had. So that is good. Now, what's the deal with our army? It feels like we have a smaller army. Oh, uh, which is true, because we don't have this anymore. Right. 
We do have money, so I think right now we should probably invite people to back us in this plot. And then we should probably also look at our spy master and see if he can... Where's our spy master? There. See if he can maybe uh, support the scheme instead of disrupt anything. Good, we have a new heir. I think that is a good choice, actually. So maybe we should uh, negotiate an alliance with that guy. I think that would be good right now since we're so small. I don't want to negotiate an alliance with this guy. We can... Ooh, yes, I would love to do this. I would love to do this. Uh, yes, 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 yes. But what is our... Okay, we are better. Our prowess is 15. Our prowess is 15. How are we doing for time, by the way? I feel like... Uh, I feel like it... No, we're fine. We're fine. I'm, I'm okay. Uh... What are we doing here? So are we going to go for humiliation? Or a weak hook? What do you have, anyway? It's like... Oh, you're Jorvik, right. What is the deal with Jorvik here? How's Fitzurk? Huh. So if we were to do the... Because we can just declare war on you, right? I think we can. So maybe we should... Go for gold? Yeah, let's go for gold. Let's do it. Trial by combat. I like it. Where's our troops? There. Marvelous news. There we go. I uh, arrive in the... Oh, there we go. It's. Uh, I thought somebody was imprisoned. Because uh, it was the same audio sample asset. I arrive in the designated spot near Jorvik in good time and find Jarl Hugni is already waiting for me, along with a small entourage of witnesses. We already read this, right? Yeah, the formalities are brief. We all know why we're here. Absolutely. Let's, let's start this thing. Trial by combat. Made the best man win. Right. For a few brief moments, Jarl Hugni and I pace in a lazy half circles, each watching for an opening. I heft my axe, ready to defend myself. While he clutches his axe firmly to hand, this fight may only be till first blood, but that doesn't ease my nerves with a sudden twitch our bout begins. Hugney tries, hesitantly, to, to launch a quick slash at me, but the blow is easily swatted away. Right. Unsure attack. No, 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 no. Yeah, that looks good. Repost. Right. I think that is good. So, um, will happen, has happened. So, medium increase to our risk of injury, high increase to our likelihood of success. Let's go for that. Robust, there we go. A leap into action, launching a flurry of click quick slashes, driving myself hard against Hugney's guard, wearing him down with each expertly timed strike. Unexpectedly, Hugney manages to swing a vicious kick for my shin momentarily hobbling me. Right. My form is good with only small er errors and Hugney's stance is failing. We are evenly matched with victory balance balancing on a knife's edge. Ooh, high to high. Right, 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 right. Low to no. I think that is better. Um, to the floor with you. Low and low. I think, I think that the best you got, you can't even hit me. Right? Yeah, let's not let's not dive in there. Let's uh, let's do this like an expert warrior, right? Time and again, I back paddle, dodge and weave, always keeping just within tempting target distance. Soon, Hugney's showing signs of exhaustion. Good, we're we're exhausting this guy. Well aware that he is utterly outmatched, Hugney hurls himself at me bodily, forcing me backwards. Wait, Hugney hurls himself at me bodily, for at me bodily. Right, with his body, right? That's what it means, I believe. I don't know. I think so. Uh, forcing me backwards with all the desperation of the doomed. My form is decent with some lap lapses, lapses, and Hugney's stance is possible. I have yet to open my opponent's guard at all, and see no way yet to claim victory. Hmm. All right, well, strike, parry, and repost, right? Victory, there we go. There we go. My axe arm moves fast as lightning as, and strikes as hard as sundered stone. Blow by blow, I beat my opponent into bloody concussed submission, hammering him onto the ground with the fury tear can with all the fury tear can lend me. When all that's left is a quivering pile of a bleeding man, I wonder if I've gone too far. Then Hugney coughs hard enough to lose his grip on his on his axe 
and I allow myself a little sigh of relief. With the worry over, I kick my foe's weapon away and lay my own against his throat. It takes a few tries, but Hugney gets the yield out eventually. Good, my friend. Let me check. You're probably, probably, probably very injured, right? You're wounded, yeah. Resting easy back in Thrim, Thrim, Thrimlingar, I exult in my success, my axe laid across my lap. Yeah, we got this one. We got this one. We counted all the coins. We put our quarrel before the gods, and the gods answered wisely. Good. I like these. I really like these. Are they good for our prowess? Because they used to be in CK2. Like, if you duel more, you basically become a better duelist. So, and there's the raid loot. Good. Our soldiers are back. Very good. Uh, shall we raid again? That is the question, isn't it? No, we should probably disband for a bit because supplies are running low. Actually, we could just pick up supplies, right? Yeah, there we go. Um... I'd like to declare war against these guys, honestly. They only have 500 men. It would be good to have a bit more land, I think, because we are a bit behind. And our scheme got discovered. Damn it. Damn it, damn it, damn it. Okay, so do they know that we are behind it? Ah, our queen is pregnant. We should probably get some concubines, by the way. And let's get a runestone as well. Sure. There. And now we can host a feast, call a hunt. We don't really need to. We have plenty of... Uh, plenty of... Headroom when it comes to stress, and I'd like to. Uh, I, I mean, I'd like I'd like to call it, but uh, let's construct that. I'd like to call it, but I don't think there's anything to gain right now. What we should do is, yeah, we should take more land, make sure we have more troops, and also our troops need to bloody replenish. It's, it's taking a long time for them to replenish. Now, honestly, we are fighting a lot, so yeah, I'd like to subjugate you, if possible. We need more. Prestige for that. Uh, we can wait for... We, yeah, we can wait for... Uh, if we get Bellum Justum. So let's go raiding. If we get the Bellum Justum, then we can probably probably do a subjugation war. Because I'd rather subjugate you, honestly. Yeah, subjugation war would be fine. Right, let's do some more raiding. Let's do this ourselves. Wow, prowess is uh, going up. Also, we should probably, probably have you... Yeah, let's focus on chivalry, I think. Although, I mean... That's a lot more altogether, right? Yeah, just assist us. I mean, I, I get it, but it, yeah, no, just assist us. Right, let's go to uh, Lotharingia, I think. Or uh, Aquitaine, right? Yeah, let's go here. Do some raiding. I think we can do one more raid, and then uh, then we'll see. Uh, by the way, this scheme, this is not happening, is it? No. Okay. Abandon that. We'll have to find another way to get you out of here. Uh, we should probably think about doing this. So yeah, characters, characters can be imprisoned. Um, but can titles be revoked? I don't think so. Ooh. We could just uh, fabricate a claim, right? Well, we have a claim. We already have a claim. Oh, we already have a claim on that, right? So, do we not have a claim? No. Okay, weird. Uh, we should have a claim, right? I mean, we are the heir here. Ugh. I'd like to... Um I'd like to fight him over this title, honestly. Let me know what you guys think is the best course of action when... Oh, 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 oh. Oh, no, 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 no. That is not good. Alright, let's go to Dockham.
Good, we gained a level of fame from that one, that's good. Uh, I'd like to get the alliance... Uh, that is the alliance with our brother, damn it. Mm. Prisoners can be ransomed, let's ransom these prisoners. Why the hell not? That was the timer, by the way. I wouldn't mind some concubines right now, but these are too old. These are too old. Right, uh... Yeah, we need to do something about the, our brother over here. I really don't like it. I could send him out and... Giving a, give him a little... I'd like, the, I'd like your title, man. Hmm. But I mean, if we take the other two titles over here, then that is fine too, right? So... Yeah, but then but first we have to go toe-to-toe -to -toe with uh, Sweden. Ugh. Right, let's do this raid first. Let's finish this raid today, and then uh, we'll call it quits for this episode. And we'll talk about what to do next episode, because there's a lot of stuff I want to do. I mean, our goal is right now to form the North Sea Empire, which uh, I think is a beautiful goal. I've never done that. I think it will be a amazing. I think it will be a good journey. I really like this Viking Let's Play. I, I'm really I'm really a fan of this. Good, your tongue is shining. What the hell are you doing? Yeah, I'm really. I'm. It, it feels really good to be in here. That's why I want to finish this raid. I kind of feel like uh, I haven't played enough Crusader Kings for today. In any case, Spouse up to the task. Uh, make sure Eagle uh, gets some guidance. No, uh, stewardship. Yeah, let's go for stewardship. Our steward. Four is really not enough. Um, wow, this has all been raided already. Wow, this has all been raided. Okay, let's go to. Uh, yeah, let's go to uh, Frankia, I think. East Frankia. How many troops do they have? Yeah, that could be iffy. Uh, let's go for Bountiful's Plunder, I think, this time. Pregnancy, good, 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 good. We need more children. We also need more concubines, so yeah. Are we not raiding? Ah, oh, we're full. We are full. Let's move back home. And then we'll call it quits once we're home. I think we've had a good episode. I really enjoyed it. And I hope you enjoyed it too. <laughs> right, there is Bellum Justum. So let's uh, let's get that in. And now maybe we should just start the subjugation war. So we'll, uh, we'll disband all of you. And then we'll push this over to here. Uh, he here, yep. Uh, no. Here. There we go. And uh, let's actually push it down one. And then we should probably start the subjugation war. Although you already lost some territory to Sweden here. That is what I was afraid of. I don't want that to happen. So let's uh, let's make sure we subjugate you. Oh, really? You have more troops now. Hmm. Who's your ally? You are. Okay, well, maybe this is an issue for next episode, right? Yeah, I think that's a good issue for next episode. Ready, guys, we are going to call it quits here. Thank you for watching. Hope you're enjoying this as much as I do, and I hope to see you on the next. Ready? Thank you. Bye-bye.